If you live in or around just about any city or town, you're being robbed. Light pollution is stealing the night sky. It's stealing money from your pocket, too, and it may even be hurting your health. Light pollution is the stray light cast into the sky by street lamps, porch lights, neon signs, and all other glowing objects that illuminate the night. It fills the sky with so much light that it overpowers most of the glory of the universe beyond. Only a handful of bright stars and planets shine through it. Every bit of that light is wasted. It's not keeping us safe from burglars or making it easier to navigate city streets because it's shining up into the sky, not down on the ground where it's needed. It creates some beautiful views for astronauts in Earth orbit, but otherwise, it's a waste. And wasted light equals wasted money. According to the International Dark Sky Association, it's costing us $10 billion a year. And to make matters worse, the electricity it requires is adding thousands of tons of carbon dioxide to the atmosphere. Light pollution interferes with the migrations of birds and sea turtles and may be clearing summer skies of fireflies. The blaze of overbright lights can make it harder for people to see at night too, making driving more hazardous. And there's evidence that it interferes with our natural day-night cycle, leading to major health problems. But light pollution is easier to eliminate than most other types of pollution. Properly designed outdoor lights are shielded so that the light goes down, not up. These fixtures need less light to get the job done, so they can use less powerful bulbs, which saves money. Many cities have enacted ordinances that restrict the types of outdoor lighting. More important, they've switched out their own street lights and other fixtures to cut down on light pollution. So a few simple changes can save money, improve safety and health, cut down on greenhouse gases, and give us back the glory of the night sky. You can help. Visit mcdonaldobservatory.org slash dark skies to find out how.